everything is connected in international business every day. We're all in the same world. We're all helping each other out. Our success has been part of moving those products. We want to be part of stuff that moves. And we've been doing it for 100 years. It comes through the port and gets distributed out. There's been multiple plywood ships that have come over from, from the Far East and China. We bring in fence pickets. We bring them in all the time. There's a lot of people building fences right now. We have a, two warehouses full of fence pickets coming in Brazil. So lumber, we, we're doing two to three vessels a month, probably about 20,000 tons every month. We could be pushing 300,000 tons in a year, depending on how, how good it is. It comes from Northern Europe. A lot of it's from Sweden and Germany and a couple other countries that are connected to that, but it comes through a German port. And it's, it, lumber's used everywhere, and, and building construction and housing development is really high right now, so it's, it's a hot commodity. Two by fours, two by sixes, two by eights, two by tens, two by twelves, all that type of stuff from five feet long to up to 16 or 18 feet long. Not many people are able to get the details involved and there's, there's a lot of times where you're trying to find one bundle with one size and length from this producer or 10 bundles of this certain thing. So a lot of our competitors put, it, put a lot of this lumber into big piles. We take the space and the time and the energy to break it all down into to exactly what the customer wants and how, it, how they do that. So that little extra service makes us different. And there's oriented to details. Um, it's really a big part of our focus in our, in our daily operation. So most trucks leaving our facility have 40 to 45,000 pounds of cargo on them. Simple math does 300,000 tons of lumber going through the terminal is about 600 million pounds. Each truck out of here has about 40,000 pounds when it leaves, so that's about 15,000 trucks of lumber that we ship out of our terminal each year. The hardest part about our business is that we want to specify our business to each customer's demand. So each customer wants their products handled a little differently or may want something different on the outbound when they, when they go out of here, or their release wants a certain wording on it. And that detail-oriented and our people, our experienced people, really make that happen on a daily basis.